Okay, we got a couple new ones. There will be some upcoming videos on these. I don't know if I'm going to make one out of two or if I'm going to if I'm going to restore them both. 85 Prairie 250s. Complete barn finds. Been sitting for a while. They both run. All the gears, clutch works great on it. Unbelievably, still run after all these years. And this is an 85. This is the Black Prairie 250. It's got the speedometer on it, showing 1600 miles. Bike's complete. This one, I think it's been sitting outside longer because of the all the uh, corrosion on the engine, the cylinder head. This one here, the plastic's worse, but the engine's in better shape. This is a, I think I got the title to them. I think this is an 83. This is a uh, KLT 200. This one's original, original seat cover. Got one bad spot in the fender over there. I'm going to leave it. They don't make these decals aftermarket, so it's not worth it. It still has the still has the the lid for the glove box. It's got your auxiliary port in there. Kind of cool to find find them with this on it. They're usually gone. Three of these are manual clutch. Clutches feel great on them. These have the uh, locking differentials where you can unlock the differential or lock it like a standard. When it's locked, it's like a standard ATC. Pretty cool. We'll have some videos coming up of these. You don't see many of these old KLTs, especially this one here. I've only seen two other ones. I'm going to call this one Darth Vader. It's pretty cool being all black. It's got the gold rims. This one here, I'll probably, I'll probably end up, I don't want to say yet, but maybe part this one out, move the plastic from this one over to this one. Plastic's trashed on this one. I can't find rear fenders for it. I've been looking and uh, no dice, and there's nothing left of it. The black one, the fenders are in real good shape. They're weathered, but they're not cracked. The tires are way too big on this one. 25 inch tires. The plastic's weathered. You can see where the where the prairie decal came off, the shine under it. I'm pretty sure I can bring this one back. There's absolutely no cracks in it. No cracks, crack, or cracks in the front cover. They're both gonna need seats or seat covers at the least. Foam's in pretty bad shape too. I did find a couple seats out there so that shouldn't be a problem. Found the speedometer cable for it. Okay, that's it on the, the KLT 250s and the KLT 200. We'll have more videos in the future of these. I don't know if I'll get on these and uh, over the winter. It's kind of crappy out there right now. It's cold in the garage. Run the torpedo heater. It does a good job. It, it's expensive. I may tackle these in the springtime. But new additions to the hoard. Okay, till the next one.